Yo, what's up guys and welcome back to Anime Evolution Simulator. So today guys, we have a new update and this one is called Update 14. Including on this new update, well, we have one new boss, one new abilities, three new areas, two new codes, new raid rewards, new defense, five rewards. I guess we're gonna have more rewards on defense guys. Seven new enchantments, six new global mission, one new passive, three new ranks, and one new class. Okay, the last update, we didn't have new ranks, but today, guys, we're gonna have new ranks. So let's go, let's go. So we are here right now on the new world, and we're gonna open the next one. This is the new one right now. It requires 292.5 and to open. So let's open this one up. Let's go. There you go, we have it open, and this one is called, uh, what's this one? So Man. Oh, we have a chainsaw team now, guys. Let's go. So, this one, we had two global missions in here. This one requires Makuma Avatar to level 60, and the other one requires Denji Avatar to level 60 as well. So, these are all the fighters available on this map. So, there you go, and we're gonna open the next one now, guys. Let's go. So, the next one requires 425 N to open. So, let's open it by one tapping. There you go. And this one over here is called Super Dragon. Nice. So we have another Dragon Ball Z team. Yep. So this one, we have two global missions as well. Kill 400 Goji 4 plus 3 fighter equips. There you go. Another plus fighters global mission, guys. Then the next one is Kill Golden Frieza. Oh, that's Golden Frieza. Is it going to be tough to kill? Let's see. Let's see. Not really, guys. I can kill this one. But what's going to be the reward? The reward is... uh Oh, Golden Frieza Avatar. Okay. Later on, we can check what's going to be the multiplier of this one. But we can kill it right now. And it's there. There you go. Later on, we will check, guys, what's going to be his, um, like, multiplier damage. But before we do that, we're gonna open the last area. This is going to be the last area. Uh, 900 and to click. There you go. Nice. We have it open. And this one is called Magic. Nice. Look at that. We have a castle in the background, guys. Amazing. And then we have another global mission here, guys. Wait. I thought we have six global mission. Okay. Okay. There's actually three global mission on Dragon Ball map. We have another one here. Goji Avatar to level 60 for times three power. Okay. I see. So that's the other one. And this is the last one of the new global mission. Requires Aladdin Avatar to level 60 for times three lock. Dude, that's actually insane. The times three lock is amazing. And this is going to be the last area on this update. Uh, what's this one over here? Oh, it's just an effect. Oh, it's moving. Nice. Anyways, let's check out the fighter. So this is going to be the fighter on this map. It requires 122.87 OCD to open. We are going to check later what's going to be the damages on these fighters. But before we do that, we are going to check the new raid rewards, guys. So we are going to go to uh, raid first. Okay, let's check out the raid first. So we are here right now. I think I've only finished like 20 plus or something on this one. Yeah, wave 30, guys. Look at that, wave 30. But, oh, oh, they changed it, guys. Before you can actually actually get like additional fighters but now they change it to power and damage okay i guess they're gonna do the same on the uh defense five let's check out the defense five there you go we are here right now but on the defense five i've actually unlocked all the rewards that i can get on this one so i'm not sure if they change it but let's check it out it's actually a mixed bag of everything we got a total of plus eight equips and uh several stuff that's actually not bad, I guess. Yeah, it's actually a lot better than before because before we only got like plus 9 pet equips but now we got a lot more perks. That's actually amazing. Anyways, this says also that we're gonna have some new enchantments and on top of that, guys, the new enchantment has a chance now to fail because the last time you can just continue enchanting your weapon and it's not gonna fail but now, you oh yeah, the new weapon I forgot to enchant. <laughs> But now, guys, there's a chance of failure. As you can see right now, this one only requires one coins. Okay, let's um, keep enchanting. Let's see if we are going to be able to enchant this one to maximum level. Uh, yeah, I keep on failing, guys. Sharpening. Oh, my God. Might of Hades. Might of Herms. Wrath of Zeus. Oh, uh, my God. I guess. I oh, there you go. I got it. Yeah, I got it, guys. There you go. Phobos Love. That's the last enchant that you can get. The secret here, guys, just continue clicking as fast as you can. And yeah, you will probably get end up getting the last enchantment, which is Phobos Love, which is amazing. And look at that. Times 4 coins, 3.85 power, times 4 damage, times 3 lock, and times 4 gems. 
that's actually amazing now we are gonna go to bleach now guys because it says that we have a new passive again the one that i've been using right now is passive 16 but i think there's a passive 17 so the new one is gonna be passive 18 okay we're gonna try re-rolling that one let's see if we can get it there you go guys i got it oh look at that guys this is a lot better because this one will give you times seven coins times eight power times eight damage times six luck and times seven gems guys 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 it's time again for us to do a super roll hopefully this time around it won't give me the passive eight again <sighs> this is gonna be the third time guys i got passive eight twice whenever i do super reroll so let's do it one more time let's see if i can get a different passive than passive eight <laughs> let's go super reroll there you go let's buy this one there you go oh passive two <laughs> no <laughs> no okay i'm gonna do it one more time guys I cannot stick to this one. It must, it must be passive 10 or above. There you go, super roll purchase. There you go, passive 13. Way better, guys. Way better. Let's clap our hands. Nice. There you go, there you go. Amazing. I finally managed to escape the passive 8 curse. <laughs> and then we have a new class as well, guys. So we are going to go to... Uh, I think it's going to be on the Overlord. No, no, no. Level solo. There you go. We are on the level solo. And we are going to check out the new class that we have in the game. There you go. As of the moment, guys, I got the minus 999, which is the strongest from the previous patch. But yeah, we have a new one now. So let's go reroll this one. There you go, guys. Master Mecha with 3.25 power. I'm not going to do a super reroll, guys, because I'm afraid that I will get a lesser value than what I have right now. So I'm going to keep it for now. But look at that, guys. The new class is called Master Mecha with times 3.25 power that's amazing guys that's amazing so so we are here right now at the magic and we are going to summon the new fighters wait let me check my relic first uh the one that i'm using right now don't have block uh this one don't have block okay this one have times three lock so we're gonna use this one and then i'm gonna use some buff as well let's go use uh one buff first there you go and yeah we're gonna summon in 15 minutes and let's see how much multiplier does this fighter give us so see you guys in a minute a few moments later and i'm back guys um, uh, to be honest, it actually took a lot longer than I expected because I didn't manage to get a Lottie in 15 minutes. So I have to extend it by a bit, like five more minutes, guys. And I've also fused all the Uko that I got. And look at that, guys. The damage of Uko is 1.01 billion. We actually entered the realm of a billion damage pet, guys. Look at that. And let's see what's the damage for, yeah, 320 million for Aladi, guys. So as you can see right now, we have Uko as 305 million and Aladi as 320 million. But the thing is, like Aladi is really hard to get 0.001% but yes as you can see guys these are all the pets so we are going to complete them later on but for now guys we are going to check the new ranks because there's actually three new ranks I just want to check it out I'm not gonna do it yet because I don't want to reset the resources that I have right now I have to complete my lineup first of Uko the new rank is called Chain Demon with times 8.2k power it requires 3 QDD gems and 900 DD power there you go so yeah there you go guys this is the new update 14 on anime evolution simulator if you want to watch more please don't forget to subscribe and like this video write in the comments below what do you think about this new update and thank you guys for watching see you again next time bye